When did you lose your virginity? To a guy or a girl? Alright you guys, it's your boy Tony Directs, and I am here with the one and only Brandon. What's up guys? Beefy Zaddy. Tarzan. Whatever the you buff Tarzan. The Silverback. Buff. Silverback. <laughs> the, the list goes on, but I am here with the one and only Brandon. What's up? Thank you for being here. And how are you feeling? I'm pretty good. You look good. Had a good workout today. Got my meals in. Feeling pretty happy right now. I should have wore uh, like a short sleeve instead of a tank top because you're just like showing me out. Oh, sorry. All I wear are tank You're tops. not sorry. I'm not sorry. You're sorry, not, not sorry. sorry. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> I have a question for you. Uh-huh. What's up? I know I didn't tell you you were asking me, like, what do you want to ask me? And I didn't tell you what I wanted to ask you, but I have a question for you. What's up? Let's hear it. You're, you're pretty open, right? You, you, you talk about a lot of things. Yeah. I got no secrets. You got no secrets? No secrets. Wow. When did you lose your virginity? To a guy or a girl? Wait, wait, wait. You lost it to a guy and a girl? Mm-hmm. I'm not a gold star gay. He is not a gold star gay. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. I'm what's a, a gold? Gay. What's a gold star gay? <laughs> you are so dumb. You are really dumb. A gold star gay is when you've only had sex with the same gender. You lose. You learn something. I learn. You lose something new. You learn something new every day. I didn't know that. Yeah. A gold a, star gay. But what's a platinum gay then? Oh, I think a platinum gay is when you've been a cesarean section, so you've never even come out of a, of a vagina. Oh my god! Wow! <laughs> You've never even touched one. That's crazy. Yo. All right, so you lost your virginity to both a girl and a guy. Well, I mean, I guess technically I lost it the first time to a girl. How was I, that? But then I lost my gay virginity to a guy. Okay, how was it? Differentiate. I want to know how the girl. Okay. So how was that? How did that come about? Well, I was 16. Okay. I was in high school. Okay. I was friends with her. Um, we were at this house party, mm -hmm. and um, we were texting back and forth because there was like a group of people in the living room, and we're texting back and forth, and she asked if I wanted to get out of here and have some fun, and I assumed she meant do something else. I don't know. <laughs> Play Uno or something. Yeah, play okay. Uno, play board games. I don't know. I don't know what she was thinking. I was naive. I was just like, yeah, this party's kind of stupid. Let's go have our own. Yeah, fun. oh, you poor innocent. So we got in my car mm -hmm. and we drove somewhere. And then I don't exactly remember how the topic came up, but she's just like, okay, so where are we doing it at? And I'm just like, doing what? She's like, where are we having sex? And I'm like, that's what you thought? I was like, okay, well, I wasn't out yet. Okay. So, um,. I said, well, I've got this car. Uh, my parents are home, so that might not be good. So I got this car we can do it in. And it was a pretty roomy back seat. I wasn't this big back then, so I didn't take up as much space. Man, I'm over here thinking she was going after the, 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 the football player, the, the, yeah. big, the big meaty one. No. And so we parked you know, somewhere secluded, but not too obvious. No, you don't want to go in a parking lot that's completely empty. You look, You stand out. So we went to a, a subdivision and parked, you know, parallel parked on the side of the road. Okay. And uh, we got in the back seat, and I don't know how many details I can give. Give as many as you want because I can just throw that little dolphin sound effect right <laughs> over it, a little bleep. So we get in the back seat, and we're uh -huh. making out, okay. and we're taking our clothes off, and uh, she starts uh, sucking my Okay. And she starts giving me hickeys down there. Mm -hmm. And so that started to get me aroused. Going. And, um, you know, I uh, stuck my fingers in there a little bit. <laughs> okay. I, I hear that's what you're supposed to do. I don't know. Uh, I guess ladies like that. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I started doing that, and I'm laying on my back in okay. the back seat, and she's sitting on me. Uh huh. So she comes on top of me, or she sits on you're top a, of me. You're a right. horse, and she's the cowgirl. Cow yeah. Okay. And all I can remember was her bouncing up and down on me, and all I could think was Nick Lachey, Nick Lachey, Nick Lachey. So uh, I had a condom on, of course, you know, I of course had protection on, but I just remember the whole time I'm in the back seat with this girl and imagining Nick Lachey the whole time. So Damn. Nick, if you're watching, <laughs> uh, <laughs> hit me up. You got me through it. <laughs> so that was the first time with the girl. I was 16. Wow. The first time with a guy. 
I was, I mean, I've had boyfriends, you know, in high school, but I never had sex with them. You had, the first wait, wait, you had boyfriends in high school? Secret boyfriends. Secret so boyfriends. I dated okay. girls publicly and had boys on the DL. But the first time I slept with a guy, mm -hmm. I was at this bar in Cincinnati with one of my straight girlfriends. And um, this was before Grinder and Scruff and all that. So you actually had to like meet people in person and actually had to talk to them, God forbid. Oh. So I see this guy there. And, he, <laughs> and so I'm, I was probably 18 or 19, probably yeah. 19. And um, I saw this big man on the other side of the bar and he looked pretty butch. Mm. And uh, so I don't know how we started talking to him, but I remember his name and I remember what he did for work. He was a fireman and he was from Texas. He was in town for a funeral. And oh, so he was DL okay. at this bar. And then here I come, starting to spit my little game. Uh huh. And I remember he wrote his name down and his number down on a napkin. That's how long ago this was. Good times, good times. And so uh, I told my friend, I said, I really like this guy. I want to, you know, do some stuff with him. I was, so she's like, Well, I don't want you to get killed. Mm. So <laughs> oh, that's a good we point. end up leaving the bar and we get in his. No, I take my friend home, I drive her home. <laughs> Drop mm -hmm. her off. Reassure Girl, get her, out. Get reassure out. Reassure her that I got this under control. So she goes home, and then we get into his pickup truck. Okay. And I'm in the passenger seat. He's driving. We drive somewhere beside of some road or something, and uh, we start making out. And he gets on top of me mm -hmm. and <laughs> lubes me up. Uh huh. And then he sits on it, and he starts riding me in the passenger seat of his pickup truck and this dude was married this dude had a kid wow, full on life. this dude was like 41 i think and i was 18 19 so it was wild that's crazy it was wild. once again we come down to the dl guys but it's you know what everyone everyone's gotta everyone's gotta they, they got it. Everyone's got it. They got it. One way they, or the they other, got they, it, got it. It. <laughs> they got it. That's crazy. Wait. Yeah. Did you ever stay in communication with him after? I don't think so. Like I said, I, I had that napkin. I probably used the napkin, so I probably threw it away. But <laughs> Yeah, so I guess the first time wasn't exactly as magical as... Uh, it wasn't romantic. <laughs> it wasn't romantic, no. It was... It was truck stop, down and dirty, two guys in a pickup truck. Just working the fire hose. Damn. You know what, getting, though? Getting the deed done. So. And you got the deed done? I got the deed done. The deed was done. It was the, done. The fire was put out. The, the box was checked. The box was checked, yes. Gotcha. Was it a happy time? It was a time. So. It was a time. Maybe it wasn't happy. No, it wasn't. But magic. it was a time. It wasn't magic. The first you know time what? the girl was in a car pretending she was Nick Lachey. The first time with a dude was in a truck. It was a moment. I just, I hope his wife isn't watching. Or his daughter. I know, right? Oh Listen my God. Well, luckily, hopefully Sorry. by now, they're, they got that whole thing situated. Yeah, maybe they're not even together anymore. Maybe they're not. But you know what, Brandon, I want to say thank you for mm -hmm. this You're amazing welcome. talk. <laughs> amazing. I was, was it amazing? I was, it was amazing. It was quite, it was quite interesting because mm -hmm. I lost my virginity to a girl. Okay. And okay. Uh, a, like a, one of those big old trucker trucks. And a big rig. Big rig. Okay. That one. Uh, and I was um, I was high. Okay. So it wasn't great. How old were you? I was 15. Okay. Uh, I came out to her after, and yeah. we just we just kept it going. We kept it going. You kept having sex. Yeah. I came out to her and she was like, but do you still want to have sex? I'm like, all right, cool. Let's okay, do it. Listen. But my first time to a guy, I will say this. It wasn't magical. And I remember crying on my way home. Because I was just so... Was he that big? No. <laughs> That's the thing. He wasn't even... It was... I felt dirty. Uh -huh. uh, the guy who I had... The guy who I lost my virginity to, I felt really dirty because... How old were you? I was tw I just turned 21. Okay. I met this guy in, in this back house, and it was really dark, and he was like, shh, just come inside. Yeah. And I heard there was a curtain dividing his room and another room. Yeah. And there was 
other things happening in the other side of the curtain. Yeah. Like other guys were having sex. And I didn't want to do it. I didn't want to do it. I was like, no, 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 I don't want to do this. He's what like, were you no. doing in a bathhouse then? It wasn't a bathhouse. It was a, it was a, you it, said was it was a, a bathhouse. It was at a back house. What's a back house? It was a house in back of another house. A garage? It was a, practically like a garage. Okay. But it was a small little house. It was like a, a guest house. Yeah, it was a guest okay. house. There okay. you go. Okay. And I remember I didn't want to do anything with him. And I just kept saying, no, I need to get something for my car. I need to get something yeah. for my car. And he was just like, no, 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 wait. Like, please don't leave. Like, he was older. He was like in his 50s. Okay. Uh, it was kind of gross. Uh huh. And I didn't want to, I, I wanted to leave. And I kept trying to leave until he finally, like, started going down on me. Mm -hmm. And I was like, all right, cool. This isn't so bad. And then it just happened. And I did not enjoy it one bit. Mm. I did not enjoy it. It was, I felt so disgusted after I, I drove home crying. Well, I don't know how it is for most people, but everyone's first time is usually messy, mm. nervous, mm. embarrassed, mm. not sure what to do. The important part is that you get the first one over with and you learn from it mm -hmm. so you can have better sex later on down the line. And that has happened. So everyone wants to have this magical first time losing my virginity, mm -hmm. balloons everywhere. Balloons, But confetti. this is the real world. This isn't a Disney movie. Unfortunately, it's not. No, no. no. So even if your first time isn't magical, There's it gonna paves be better the times. way. Yeah. It paves the way for better times. You live and you learn. You get better at it preach and then you you know you move from a pickup truck or a big rig to a, to a bed a, a bath or a bed yeah a bathtub a bed what yeah a bed oh my bad you move to a bed where it's or cozy a kitchen and counter it's, or, or, a kitchen or, ca or a couch or the front seat a limo Ooh, or a couch damn. or a, a penthouse in vegas or a penthouse in vegas <laughs> that works a beach a beach? The waves. Your, the comfort of your own bedroom? That's no fun. How is that not fun? <laughs> it's boring. It can be fun sometimes. You know what? This conversation is over. For those of you guys who want to follow Brandon, follow him right here on Instagram. Follow him on all his other stuff. And then we got some stuff. What's my Instagram? Yeah, tell me. It's, they're, they're, it's, they're, it's, oh, all over it's right there. Oh, oh, it's okay. literally right there. It's right there. Sorry, I can't see it. All right, y'all. Thank you guys so much, and thank you, Brandon. Thank you, Tony. Thank um, you. Thank you for watching, for I'm listening gonna, to I'm this gonna wrap, mess. I'm going to wrap this all up. Yeah. I'm going to yeah. wrap it up. Yeah, let's I wrap think it it's up. time for you to go home. I, oh, wait. We're, we're at my home. Oh. Get, get, the, get out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> Boy. <laughs>